Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into a crucial health topic that you shouldn't ignore, poor circulation. Now you might be thinking, Dr. Mike, how can I even tell if I have bad circulation? Well, that's what we're here to discuss. There are some sneaky signs your body might be giving you that often get brushed off. We're talking about those subtle cues that, if ignored, could lead to more serious health concerns down the road. So, if you're ready to become your own health advocate and learn about the eight hidden signs of poor circulation, stick around, let's jump right in. Let's talk about your hands and feet. Are they constantly cold, even when it's not that cold? This could be a sign of poor circulation. Blood carries oxygen and nutrients throughout the body. Poor circulation means less efficient delivery. It's like a traffic jam in your arteries. Blood flow slows, leaving hands and feet cold. Next time you kick back and relax, take a look at your lower legs and ankles. Noticing any puffiness or swelling? This is called edema, a sign your circulation needs a tune-up. Gravity pulls fluid down to our legs. Our veins and valves pump it back up. Sluggish circulation leads to swollen ankles and feet. Persistent swelling can signal serious circulation issues. We all experience fatigue from time to time, especially in our go-go-go world. But if you find yourself feeling constantly drained, even after a good night's sleep, poor circulation could be the culprit. Remember how our blood delivers vital oxygen and nutrients to our muscles and organs? Well, when that delivery system isn't working optimally, those energy factories in our body don't receive the fuel they need to function at their best. This can leave you feeling sluggish, weak, and like you're running on fumes no matter how much coffee you drink. It's like trying to run a marathon on an empty stomach. Chapter four, numbness and tingling. When your body sends an SOS. Ever experienced that pins and needles sensation or a feeling of numbness that comes and goes? These sensations can be a warning sign of poor circulation. When blood flow is compromised, nerves don't get the oxygen they need. This leads to tingling or numbing feelings. Don't ignore these signals. Chapter 5, Varicose Veins, More Than Just a Cosmetic Concern Varicose veins, those bulging, twisted veins, are often thought of as a cosmetic issue, but they can also be a sign of poor circulation. When vein valves weaken, blood can pool, putting pressure on vein walls. This causes veins to twist and bulge, resulting in varicose veins. Have you noticed that cuts, scrapes, or wounds seem to take forever to heal? This could be another sign that your blood circulation isn't as efficient as it should be. Healing is a complex process that relies heavily on a steady supply of oxygen and nutrient-rich blood. When blood flow is restricted, it's like trying to rebuild a house with a limited supply of materials. The process slows down, making it harder for your body to repair itself efficiently. So if you're noticing that even minor wounds seem to linger, it's worth having a conversation with your doctor. Our brain is like a high-performance machine, requiring a constant supply of oxygen and nutrients to function at its best. When circulation is compromised, our brain might not receive the fuel it needs, leading to cognitive issues. You might experience brain fog, difficulty concentrating, or even memory problems. It's like trying to run a complex software program on a computer with a slow internet connection. Things just don't work as smoothly. If you're noticing a decline in your cognitive function, don't just brush it off as senior moments. It could be a sign that your circulatory system needs attention. Believe it or not, our gut health and circulatory system are closely connected. Our digestive system requires a healthy blood supply to function properly. When circulation is poor, digestion can be affected, leading to issues like constipation, bloating, and even abdominal pain. Think of it like this. Our digestive system is like a well-oiled machine with each part relying on the next to function correctly. When blood flow to the digestive tract is reduced, that machine starts to sputter and slow down, leading to uncomfortable symptoms. So if you're experiencing frequent digestive problems, it might be time to address the root cause and improve your circulation. If you notice any of these signs, it's important to consult with a healthcare professional. They can help determine the underlying cause and recommend the best course of action. Remember, taking care of your circulatory system is crucial for your overall health and well being. Simple lifestyle changes like regular exercise, a balanced diet, and staying hydrated can make a world of difference. 
Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more health tips. Stay healthy, everyone.